If you're looking to buy small to team coins, then go check out cheaputcoins.com. All the links are down below in the description box. And use discount code of GC5 to get your 5 cent discount on all of your orders, guys. They are cheap, reliable, and also have an instant coin service, which will get you coins in around 5 seconds. What is up guys, Jason Messi here and welcome to the second upload of the day. Today we have got a new episode of Potential Summer Transfers Hybrids. It's episode number two and the first one went down absolutely incredible guys. So again, if you know 1,500 likes, that would be greatly appreciated. And in the comments below, let me know what three rumors I should do next. And finally, if you missed my previous video from today, make sure to check it out. It was a FIFA 08 Generations video. Uh, I'll leave a link to that in the description below. And um, the three players today are going to be Mats Hummels, Ronaldinho and this man, Samuel Eto'o. Three, um, I'd say Eto'o's very, very overpowered. Ronaldinho is an absolute legend and Hummels is just a solid solid defender the team is a 3-5-2 I did try a 4-2-3-1 and personally absolutely hated it that was the wide variant and it did not work whatsoever and uh, if you want to see what clubs these players are linked to I'll leave a link in the description below as well to the actual potential summer transfers videos uh, where you can see each individual player um basically in that video. So the team, like I said, is a 3-5-2, very, very solid defense. Felipe Santana is in the middle. Naldo, the right center back, and obviously Hummels at uh, left center back. You have any goalkeeper you want that's from the Bundesliga. Um, but for me, personal choice, I wasn't going to include Benaggio, but I did include him on the last squad builder, so I wanted to vary it up a little bit. Uh, but Manuel Neuer, as solid as it comes, probably the best goalkeeper on the game. And then we've got Luis Gustavo. He's on every single one of our squad builders because he is so damn good. And luckily in this team, he was the one that gave the chemistry. So I was kind of losing now there's like an excuse maybe to actually include him but uh, left mid is Andre Scherler and um, this guy doesn't really seem to do anything for me but he actually plays quite well and two goals two and uh, two assists in the 21 games isn't very good at all for a left mid and then got Rossini and uh, guys Liga do Brazil where uh, Rondini and Rossini play obviously Rondini has not actually got a club at the moment um, but the Liga do Brazil is out of FIFA 15 completely that means the likes of Wallace and Pato uh, Jobson again they're all gone Kaká will not be on FIFA 15 um, it's quite a big shame really because they've got some very, very big names in that league and uh, yeah they're just not in there because they've uh, had some licensing issues so what do you make of that guys in the comments below are you annoyed that Liga do Brazil has gone or do you think it kind of opens up a, a new side of things where EA yeah, could potentially get the Turkish league the Ukrainian league and in them ones we're probably get a lot more five star skills than we actually had on this one so overall I think it's kind of a, a decent position to be in um, and hoping, oh, hopefully they do release a, a new full league uh, to replace it the two strikers though we had Lukaku on the right striker and Eto on the left and then um, if you look at the goals to gain for Eto, it's not great, but the assist kind of makes up for it. Uh, 15 goals and 14 assists isn't too shabby. And this is the price of the team. I use 382k. Uh, Rosina's price is not there for some reason. That's the most expensive version with all in forms. Would not suggest that at all. And that's the cheapest version. I'd probably rock with that. 87k for this team. I definitely recommend trying it out, guys. And uh, Hummels. Um, his pace seems a lot better on that green card I'm not going to lie it's not his highest version it's just one I had in a pack a, a few weeks ago so I thought I'd keep it and uh, that's how it really went from there and um, I don't know the, the price difference between the most uh, all, the, all the informs and no informs the team's not a, like a 3.8 million team. I'd, I'd not say that at all. Um, I, I'm not going to lie to you there. Um, if you have the coins, I still wouldn't recommend it because it's just a waste of your coins when you get pretty much the same team or the exact same team with a few less stats. And the next bit... Um, like I said, I tried the 4 2 3 one wide and it's absolutely horrible. 3 5 2 for me works an absolute charm. I don't know if it's a preference or not, um, but I do tend to like 4 2 3 one But Ronaldinho as the cam and Eto as a lone striker did not. I wasn't feeling that at all. And um, it's overall, it's a very, very nice team on the counter attacks. Probably his best area actually running through. And you always have someone next to you. If you're a bit of a sweaty bastard, uh, to tramp that across. And any Bundesliga goalkeeper, um, like I said, I went with Neuer because it's kind of the first choice to go through. And I actually had him in my club at the time so I was like why not try uh, Neuer again and um, can't say I regret that whatsoever <laughs> and Luis Gustavo the man of dreams uh, the best CDM on the game for me by an absolute country mile and he isn't every one of my squad builders for a reason because he is that damn good and finally like I said the counter attack is very very good because you've got one very strong striker and one, one very very quick striker and uh, they kind of assist each other and as you notice them um, both my quite average goal to game ratios they both had very very good amount of assists for how many games they played guys so like I said 1,500 likes for more potential summer transfers hybrids that is a mouthful check out the today's uh, previous video in the description below and uh, yeah guys thank you for watching this video and i will see you next time